Hey YouTube, I'm back, moving stuff. I got new things. Look at that ass, uh. So, this got delivered last night. It's uh, 1976, I believe. Um, and it is pretty rusted, uh, as you can tell, but I actually got a whole bunch of other parts, including uh, a really decent rear tub from the firewall back. I guess they call that a three quarter tub, I think. Um, and so, hold on, hold on. I'm getting a call. I don't feel like answering that. Probably about my, uh, right? It's probably about my extended warranty. <sighs> Anyways, I gotta move this because somebody's coming to pick up an engine and they have to roll through here. But uh, it was, it's, I'm pretty sure the front axle's locked up. The rear axle seemed to bust free when the tow truck was bumping it off. The rear axle started moving finally. So I think the front end's uh, still froze up. So we're gonna see what we can do. put it in first and then uh, four low and then bump forward that's because I drive uh, a Defender where the shift pattern is completely different and I do that quite often I guess that's me saying I'm dumb but heavy-duty bumpers we're good uh... Since it's actually rolling, I'm gonna get the winch out and winch it. That way I can stay on the steering wheel. I'm not gonna lie, I just made an eight minute video of me talking too much. I talk too much and I, I'm doing it again. So let's check it out. Here it is in all its rusted glory. Um, it will be something someday. I'm not gonna scrap the whole thing. Uh, I, 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 my original plan when I f first found it was to literally uh, like weld in straps of uh 20 gauge to just keep it from falling apart and drive it like this because i think it's awesome um but also you know maybe not because i already have something like that so uh, i came with a rust free uh three quarter rear tub to replace all of this rusted out crap um but i'm probably just going to sell that i really want to uh make this into NFJ truck, maybe a little extended cab FJ truck uh, sitting on this TJ frame with a small block Chevy in it, probably. That's my plan, but that's like two years from now. I have four builds uh, ahead of it right now on my list because because uh, I'm dumb. I'm just, I'm putting too much on my plate, but I like to eat, so it's all good. Um, Anyways, so we got some extra parts in here. We got a tire carrier, rear seat backs. Um, we have 
I don't know like what's rare on these and what's not, but I really like this little uh, Super Japan um, map light. I hope I can refurb that because that's just badass. Uh, it's got the four speed, um, 2F engine. I think I said all that. Uh, I got, I, I opened the glove box earlier on the other video that I'm not gonna post and found the door limiting uh, mechanism, so that's nice. Uh, these seats, it's got the tumble, tumble forward seats. I don't know if those are rare either. I gotta do a little research. I'm not really like an aficionado. I just like the way they look and so I'm getting into them. Um, it's got the factory roll bar, which I need, which is great. Uh, I really need another one. Someone's got one laying around and wants to uh, help me out. Um, it's got the seat belts, which may or may not work. I don't know yet. We'll go through it a little more in depth right now. I just got to get it moved. Actually, I don't have to get it moved because as soon as I pulled this winch out, the guy called and canceled on the engine. So, um, he didn't really cancel, he just uh, moved it to Thursday instead of Tuesday. And he seems pretty genuine, so uh, it's all good. Either way, that engine will sell eventually. Um, you know, and a lot of this, uh, I like I like this hood a lot other than this rot right here. Um, so I'm hoping that I can uh, find a patch panel or another hood. He actually has another hood that I think, if I remember correctly, is rotted out on this side. So. Um, I haven't picked up a bunch of extra parts that I'm getting. Like I said, tub, hood, some fenders. They're all uh, rusty, but not as rusty as this. Um, and then some really clean uh, rear Ambo doors um, that I'll just sell because I'm not gonna use them. And I'll probably end up selling the rear quarter tub also. Uh, and what else? Matching keys, ignition, doors, uh, uh, gas can. Uh, or gas lid. I don't know that that's, I'm, I'm from the Jeep world. So to find that, like if I found that in a CJ7, I'd be really excited. Uh, anyways, I think that's it. It seems like it might be about to rain. So I'm going to get inside and uh, y'all have a good one.